Hello and welcome back to Backbone. Um, ha have you seen the movie, um, uh, How to Get Ahead in Advertising Without Really Trying? Yeah. Stale of, uh, smell of damp grounds and sweat. Where am I? Sole purpose of my existence is to gaze upon yourself through me. I'm here for you. I'll always be here for you. Gaze upon myself. Your face looks different. Your body is transforming. You're being struck in a perpetual becoming. You don't recognize yourself, but that's all right. Look at my face. Scars of lives lived, past taken, words pronounced. Newborn flesh is ripping through the seams, discovering the boundaries of what it means to be you. Look deep into my eyes. Dilated pupils reflect dim light coming from the opening in the tent. Your ices are unstable. Liquid spheres of muddy color. Refocus the gaze. Take another look. Let me know what you see. Try to look at my back. Multiple bulbous tumors are tearing through your shirt, pulsating, hunger for control over your lean, dehydrated flesh vessel. <sighs> Smell the air. Every person has a distinct scent. Yours is different now. Something new commanding your being in yet unknown directions. Listen to the tumors. Flesh speaks again, but language you can't understand. Touch. Wet, malleable, greasy tissue. Fingers make indentation in doughy exterior. Something inside of it pushes back with force. Look at it again. Take another look. Let me know what you see. Try to recognize myself. Not much left the person you once were. Some parts are still there, lingering. Echoes in the cavern deep down that pronounces, I am, I am, I am. Nobody can hear you scream. Who am I? You are me. I am you. Ah! The air is pierced by silence. You watch your mouth gape open and emit a single short breath. Oh. I am, I am, I am. You are, you are, you, you are. You focus the gaze. Take another look. Let me know what you see. Stumble away. Goodbye, old friend. I will see you again when the sky has reached the horizon. Goodbye. Howie, you finally awake. You have me worried. Been out for two days. Anatoly. Take it easy. What in the shepherd's name was that, man? What the fuck is that thing on your back? I don't know what happened. Where are we? We're under the bridge now, among friends. No one knows we're here. How did we get here? Through the sewers. Found you in an alley, near a dead body. But there was no weapon or anything. You were totally out of it. Did I kill Anatoly? Let's talk about this later. You're going to be alright. Better not worry. He's dead because of me. Howard, I've known you for ten years. You're not a murderer. I fucking killed him, Larry. Howard, it's not your fault. Please, I want to help you. I'm so sorry. He was my friend. I don't understand. I know, but I'm also your friend. It's going to be all right. We'll figure this out together. I don't know what to do. It's honestly best if we don't talk about this right now. You're still in shock. I don't know what want to make it worse. You hungry? What's happening to me? You've been in and out with a bad fever. What's that thing on your back? What's that look like to you? I don't know, like a fucking tumor growing from your spine? What the fuck? How bad is it? How does it feel? It's pulsating, dear me. Doesn't feel like anything. I don't know, my mind is foggy. What the fuck, dude? How'd this happen? I was infected by an organism in a secret government lab. <laughs> yeah, that sounds... thing. Uh, sure. You must have a fever. How can I help? I fucked it. I fucked everything up. Calm down, Howie. We're together. We're safe. I gotta get out of here. Gotta warn her. Who? About what? This thing. It's not safe. You're babbling. Take it easy. How about a nap? Gotta tell Renee everything, Larry. Please. You're not going anywhere in the state you're in. Who's Renee? She's the one I need to protect. Okay, but not in your current state. I'm scared, Larry. Listen, we'll find out what to do later. Sun will go down soon. We'll get a fire started. Can you walk? Now, oh, what's the point? Can't just lie here and die. Might you do some good to have a little walk and find some firewood? Ask people at the camp where to get it. 
Are there people out there? I'm a freak, Larry. I'm not going to judge. Introduce yourself. Get to know him. It's your new home, after all. Introduce myself? What if I hurt someone? You won't. I'm all right. See? Go and run some errands. Away from the camp. Make a plan together. Later, I promise. You're leaving me? Listen, I'm not scared as you. I'm going to go take care of you. But first, I need to do a thing first. Go get some wood. Make sure it's dry. All right. Great. Hey, hey, new guy. Excuse me, but are you okay? Ah, tuba? Yeah, I'm doing my scales. Can't talk. Honk. I'll get you later. Looks well used. Smells kind of good, actually. Sorry, concentrating. What are you playing? Beggar's blind. I'll teach it to you another time. Oh, I'm Ryan. Howard. Hello, old chap. My, my, you don't look so good. Sorry about that. It's quite all right, chap. Glad you're up. I'm North. Welcome to the camp. Sorry about me. If you want to talk about it, that's cool. No one's here is going to pry, so worry not. Need a third player? I'm afraid this game is halfway through. Maybe we can deal you in the next one. Perhaps tomorrow? I get it. Appreciate it. Be seeing you, old chap. Yeah, good luck. Well, definitely no uh, dry sticks in the river. That would be the exact opposite of dry sticks. Oh, Casey uh, explosion. Hey, uh, I'm Howard. Nice to meet you. Hey, Howard, I'm Casey. Sorry about the look. It's okay. Did I already tell you about me already? Mm-hmm. Okay. Sorry. Bye. Sorry, I'm just very tired. I know the feeling. And Dio. Yeah, all sorts of uh, sponsors and stuff here. Oh, you're the sick guy. Welcome. Name's Dio. Wait, are you the Dio that messaged Rose? How do you know about Rose? Don't fucking lie to me. I will know and I will fuck you up. Daisy Bloom. How do you know that? Long story. I was investigating the bite. Investigating for whom? Speak straight, boy. For my partner, Renee. She's an investigative journalist. What are you ex uh, investigating exactly? Clarissa Bloodworth. What she did to the girls. Well, you are a shitty investigator, then. How so? I'm a scavenger. I get people all over the wall. Rose is safe. Clarissa is the one sponsoring the whole operation. Clarissa is funding you? You have a deal with her. Yeah, she helps get people out. But she's a fucking murderer. I've heard that. I don't give two shits about where the money comes from. As long as I can go outside and help people. I'm not quite sure what to say. Then don't say anything. I can discuss my moral compass with you. Get fucked if you don't like it. Rose is safe. What does that mean? She is alive. That's all I can tell you. What about Leslie Palm? My louder. Leslie is with Rose. I didn't make it. What do you mean she didn't make it? She was shot on the way here. I'm sorry. Sh shot by whom? Who do you think? Border Patrol. We did what we could. I can't tell you more. I won't relive it again. What's there over the wall? That's something I won't tell anyone. Sorry. Maybe you'll find out yourself one day. Can't you tell Florence? Kills me, but no. For Rose's safety, she can't know. One slip, that'd be it. Glad Rose is okay. Yeah, every person out of the shithole is a huge achievement. Other people here know about you? Not so often. Sometimes a girl will wait here until stuff is ready. People know not to ask. That's trusting of them. The uh, less they know, the better. So you've helped other people escape too. Not as many as I'd like. It's a risky process. Now risky. It takes months of prep. Few people are involved, but they can't 
have much contact. If we ever fail, you're incredible. It's something I have to do. Still, must be super hard on you. Huh, you're right it is. Never sure how anyone's acknowledged that. Maybe I don't even. Can you take me outside the wall? No, don't ask why. In fact, stop asking so many questions. I'm just curious. I don't have time for that. It's all I need to know. Thank you. Yeah, it felt good to talk about it, actually. Or I can actually find some firewood. Keep heading left. Not exactly a forest, but you'll find it. Well, it was nice meeting you. Bye. Bye. Keep heading left, or straight on, you know, as would be actually said. Branch looks promising. That took a lot out of you. Death is coming to us all. No reason to be uncool about it. I am absolutely not cool about it. It's not like you have a choice. Of course I have a choice. Are you sure? Yeah. Interesting. I know you better than anyone, yet I can't tell if you're lying. You don't know me, no one does. You don't know me, no one does. You don't know me, no one does. You can never truly know anyone, most of all yourself. Time to wake up. I exist again. I don't know one wants to talk. Got wood? I see your sense of humor hasn't changed. What can I say? I'm your rock, steady and dependable. People seem wary of me. You're new. Give them a chance. We're a tight knit group. Everyone here is been hurt before. I just hope it doesn't cause trouble for you. It won't, as long as you behave. Now you sound like Renee. Renee is the most important thing to you, isn't she? Nah, you're just as important. I hope I can believe that soon. But she is the one in danger. That needs my help. Doesn't seem like she's trying hard uh, to find you, though. The oh, fuck you implying? Oh, come on, Howie. Look about you. See who your real friends are. I don't deserve friends. Then consider me your fairy godmother. And what does my fairy godmother think we do next? I don't know, Howie. Just live one day at a time here. Should try it. You show me how? Look, just get through tonight. Tomorrow we can find out a plan for whatever you want to do. You promised we'd talk tonight. It's late already. Can we just chill by a nice warm fire? We both need to relax. Alright, fine. But I'm getting out of here tomorrow. You again. Who am I? I am what I am. You are what you are. I am my thoughts. I think, therefore, I am. And what are they made of? Electric currents triggered by chemical reactions. Brace yourself for the current. I'm ready. You won't ever be ready. Change sweeps you away when you least expect it. Then you've changed. But you've changed nothing. I exist again. Really not looking good. Hey, you trying to sneak out on me? You just look so cozy. Yeah, I'm a regular snuggle bug. I gotta go. Hang on. Can we have a chat first? What happened to you and what's her plan? Yeah, you wanna know what happened? Yeah, we share the weight, dude. Bloodworth is killing people. Apes are eating them. 
What? Is that a metaphor? And then there's some fucked up research at the Science City. Like what? Some kind of DNA splicing. Something got into me. Fuck, you know I've always got your back. I'm out of my death here. How can I help? Can you track Renee Wilson down? Wilson. Huh. Spelling error. I can ask around my usual contacts. Few of us keep our ears to the ground and trade rumors. But do you have any leads for me? Hmm. It's a hunch, but check the burning park. If you say so, street we know often hangs out. We'll ask him to keep an eye out. Looney, I met him. Tell him I say hi. Okay, that's a story for another time, I guess. I will do. What does a good lie, uh, gal look like? She's a fox. Young. Pretty. Usually wears green. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Might owe me some unusual people. Big favor, though. Need to find a way to let people know what's happened to me. Then what? Even if they believe you? That's up to them. I've done my part. You say so. Can you get me some meds to treat my condition? I don't know, man. I have a few sources, but you don't know what's wrong with you. Not telling what I got can even be cured. No, yeah, but antibiotics could help. I could try and rustle up some. Maybe ask Roger. He's a doctor. Now I'm ready to make a decision. What'll it be? We can only do one thing today, but we might try again tomorrow. Eh, try to find Renee. I'll ask the usual suspects. Really can't promise anything. Well, you're a true friend, Larry. Glad to be. Wish me luck. In the meantime, get to know folks. Maybe help prepare the group dinner tonight. Yeah, sure I'm invited? Of course, you're one of us now. Should help them out while I'm gone. Alright, see you later, Larry. Hello, young fellow. Roger Betty. Pleasure to meet you. Hey, I'm Howard. Forgive me for not being blunt, but I'm a doctor. What the nature of your position? Never seen anything like it. <coughs> Can I see? I'm not sure. It's complicated. Happy to hear it if you want an ex, ex professional opinion. <coughs> Let's have these things uh, checked out. You don't sound too good yourself. Yes, I'm rather afraid I've come down with a respiratory condition. That serious? No, no, nothing. A few botanicals and some rest won't fix. Can, can I help? That'd be very kind of you. Got my hands full with everyone else's requests. Yours to command. A cup of tea would do me good, but I need some herbs. You can find them in a forest area nearby and on the farm. Joshua's about to go. You can keep him company. And if he wants to? Sure, I guess. Don't mind doing it myself. Come on, Joshua. Do you both good. What exactly do we need? Kalantuma, thyme, and sage. Alright, we're going then. Come on, man. Let's go. Okay. Time. Hey, Howard, how are you? Well, I woke up this morning. <laughs> I love that, it's true. Kind of beautiful. Looking for some sage. Growing any? Sure, it's basically a perennial here. What do you got in mind? Helping Roger with his cough, keeping myself busy. Ah, uh, it's tea, sure. You seem skeptical? Am I that transparent? That's the gossip. Eh, it just seems odd to me. Guy's a doctor. Never known one who believes in holistic medicine. Maybe he's trying something new. Maybe. Maybe it's a smoke screen. Has his condition get, getting worse? I don't know. Doesn't like to talk about it. There's another explanation, of course. He's making it? It's possible. Not sure why. Some people are strange. Maybe it's psychosomatic. Could be. We've all been there. Yeah, I'm not judging. Just keep an eye on him. That's all I prefer. For honesty, but I'll settle for harmless. 
gotcha. I'll take the sage anyway. Here, I'll cut you a few stems. Appreciate it. No problem, bro. Get any help gardening? Of course, let's get dirty. All right, where do I start? Okay, well, that'll be it for this time. When we come back, oh, going to the poor quarters where the ragged people go, looking for only places only they would know. Lila lie, folks.